let this be a warning. This is what you guys are getting yourself in for. Or into. And this is not all of it. All right, I warned you all in advance. Got a bunch of boxes of stuff. We're going to open a little bit of on a little. Well, uh, if I could speak English, it would be awesome. This is one of the reasons that I really don't take student groups anymore is because uh, my IT, my eye teeth get tangled up around my tongue and I can't see what I'm saying. I don't know. Anyhow, we're going to open some of these boxes. Be right back. All right. First box. Now, funny story about this one. Whoever delivered it was nice enough to put it in a plastic bag. Now, it wasn't raining when they delivered it. And it, there was no rain in the forecast. In fact, it was a nice, bright, sunny day. But, uh... They left this on the on the on, on the hood of my truck, out in the sun, and it was funny because even though they protected it from getting rained on, being out there in the sun, the inside of this plastic bag had a lot of condensation on it. It's a good thing that uh, this is not something that's going to get hurt by getting wet. Now the box will get hurt. But the contents will be fine, if this is what I think it is. The box is heavy enough that I think I know what is in here. This is two of the large folding grills from Pathfinder. And uh, I remember when we were prototyping these things, we were trying to get a bigger version of the small packable grill. This is what was decided upon. Comes with a nice carrying bag. Plenty big enough for a skillet in a bush pot. A couple of bush pots. Where I like to use these things is on top of my Dutch oven table. Of course, they're great in a the campfire too. So, I do not know what the dimensions are on this thing, but we'll find out. Uh, 16 and 3 quarter, a little over, call it 17, by almost 13 inches. I've got plenty of room on here for probably a skillet and a bush pot, and uh, you can keep plenty of coals under there and keep different zones. So this is not as hot or this or whatever. So uh, that's it. Absolutely gorgeous. Maybe we'll do some cooking on this thing this weekend or this week, this coming week. So there you have it. That's the new Pathfinder Large Folding Grill. So here we go. Take a look at the bag. Kind of a nylon-y kind of material. I like that to work out good. I'll probably be keeping one of these in the van with me. I'm on here at the home. Like I said, I, I, I cook a lot on my Dutch oven table. And uh, 
I like using this to get my pans and things raised up. Up till now, I've been using two or three of the small ones. So we'll be switching to this and we'll be doing, messing with it and seeing how it performs. As always, you can find this gear in one or two places. That's not true. Um, so I got a link in my description box to my affiliate page. You want to help me get a little bit of cut of the SRO action? So this works out good for you. If you're a fan of Salty Dog Outdoors, you can help me out by giving me a little cut. If you're a fan of SRO, you can help them out by purchasing the gear from them. If you're not a fan of SRO, then you can help me out and take a little bit of money away from them and give it to me. So, talk to y'all later. Bye.